penis cancer sufferer receives heartfelt letter from King Charles in recognition of his courageous advocacy, a touching moment has emerged from the ongoing battle against cancer. As a man who bravely shared his diagnosis of penile cancer has received a heartfelt letter from none other than His Majesty King Charles III. Roger Cartwright, a 76-year-old radio host and retired academic, was diagnosed with penile cancer in 2012. Shortly after his diagnosis, he underwent surgery to remove a tumor, marking the beginning of a long and challenging journey. Over the years, Roger has faced the disease head-on, enduring multiple surgeries and participating in a vaccine trial designed to slow the progression of his condition. Despite the sensitive nature of his illness, Roger has displayed remarkable courage in discussing his experiences, recognizing the importance of raising awareness about penile cancer. In an effort to combat the stigma surrounding this often overlooked condition, Roger took the brave step of sharing his story publicly through a local newspaper. This courageous act caught the attention of King Charles III, who had previously revealed his own cancer diagnosis in February. Inspired by the king's openness, Roger penned a letter of gratitude and support, expressing his admiration for the royal family's commitment to raising awareness about health issues. On September 11th, an unexpected letter arrived at Roger's home, addressed to Lieutenant Commander Roger Cartwright. With a hint of humor, Roger joked about the possibility of being called up to fight Putin, unaware of the touching message contained within the envelope. To his astonishment, the letter from Buckingham Palace included warm wishes for his health and a heartfelt acknowledgement of his efforts to raise awareness about cancer symptoms and signs. I was genuinely moved to receive such a personal response from the palace, Roger reflected. Typically, you might expect a standard response to letters, but this was so much more than that. The king had personally acknowledged Roger's struggles expressing that he was inspired by Roger's positive outlook and commitment to spreading awareness about cancer. Roger was particularly struck by the king's willingness to share his own health challenges with the world, noting how significant this was compared to previous generations when such topics were often kept private. What the king has done is incredibly useful for many cancer sufferers, and Princess Catherine's involvement is equally important, he remarked. If my story can encourage even one person to visit a doctor about their concerns, then I feel I have made a meaningful contribution. While Roger faced significant health challenges, including two strokes in 2019, he was initially reluctant to share his diagnoses publicly. However, a supportive doctor encouraged him to raise awareness about penile cancer, a rare condition that is rarely discussed in social settings. It's one of those things that people don't typically talk about openly, he admitted. But I've learned that sharing my experience can make a difference. Describing the onset of his symptoms, Roger recalled, I have been experiencing issues for some time, and they were gradually worsening. After consulting with a specialist, who is the only one qualified to treat this type of cancer in Scotland, Roger was advised that immediate surgery was necessary. He had initially planned to return from a scheduled work trip before undergoing treatment, but the urgency of his condition led to him being operated on just three days later. Following his initial surgery, Roger's doctor suggested he participate in a groundbreaking vaccine trial aimed at fighting the disease. The vaccine, typically administered to teenage girls, offered a new avenue for treatment, and despite the looming possibility of amputation, Roger chose to proceed with the trial. I believe that regardless of the outcome, there would be valuable lessons learned from the experience, he explained. Ultimately, the trial proved beneficial, significantly slowing the progression of his cancer. While I know it will never completely go away, I have a fantastic consultant who continues to monitor my condition closely, Roger stated with gratitude. Through his journey, Roger Cartwright has become a symbol of resilience and hope for many facing similar battles, demonstrating the power of sharing one's story and the importance of raising awareness about health issues that often remain shrouded in stigma. His connection with King Charles serves as a reminder of the impact that open conversations about health can have on individuals and communities alike.